Hello guys, Marian from uh, electroschematics.com Here I have uh, a simple uh, Arduino project that measures uh, three different temperatures I am using uh, in this case uh, a digital uh, thermal sensor it is about uh, TC74 the, and I'm using the I2C protocol, the IC, I2C communication from the, that uses only two wires, as you can see, the SDA and the SEL. So basically, I'm using only two wires from the Arduino board, and I. I can connect up to seven or eight different uh, temperature sensors to measure uh, the temperature in different locations. I have only three components right now, so basically I can measure three temperatures at the same time. This uh, TC74. Uh, Sensor is uh, quite interesting. Let me show you its uh, data sheet. As you can see, it's a digital temperature sensing and can measure uh, temperature between uh, 0 and uh, 125. Actually, you can measure even more. It uses uh, the I to I square C protocol, the well known two wire interface, and uh, here is uh, how you m must connect it. It has uh, on pin two the SDA, and uh, on pin four the SCL. Pin three is ground, pin five is uh, voltage. Plus the voltage that you must apply to it. I have in this in my case I have a five volts uh, type. You can buy it even in three point three volts, but I'm using the five volts uh, type right now. And uh, what you must know is that uh, you every device, every component has a certain uh, address. In my case, I am using the TC74A0, which has this address, and the, the other one is A2 with this address, and the third one is A3 with this address, this binary address. All you have to do is uh, Use a simple Arduino code. I will um, post a link below this uh, video to the, art to the article where you can download the code and you can read more about this uh, project. So, as I told you, you have to use uh, these uh, individual addresses. If you want to allow an uh, I square C communication between your Arduino board and each individual uh, sensor. So as you can see I'm using here three addresses. Address 1, address 2 and address 3. Here I have the decimal uh, value. I have converted the binary address to the dec decimal. On this piece of paper I have uh, converted from binary to decimal. So as, as you can see TC74A0, in this case the first one, it has this binary address which converts to 72, the second one A2 and the third one A3 converts to 74 and 75. So basically these are the addresses that you need to use 
inside your Arduino sketch and uh, what uh, these sensor outputs can be read on the serial um, monitor probably you can see sensor 1 reads uh, 24 degrees sensor 2 24 and sensor 3 25 now I will um, put my soldering iron on sensor 1 so we should uh, see an increase in its temperature and uh, I hope you can see 40, 41, 42 the other sensors have the same temperature and now I will uh, put the solder soldering iron on uh, sensor 2 we should see a drop in temperature of sensor 1 and an increase of temperature on sensor 2 so as you can see the sensors are measuring the temperature properly and I am using only two wires only two pins from uh, the Arduino board and of course the power supply plus in the ground 5 volts I will uh, post the circuit also in the article and uh, by the way you don't have to use uh, you can use uh, other type of sensors not only temperature sensors you can use any sensor that has uh, the possibility to connect uh, I square C protocol that allows I square C communication. In my case, I have used temperature sensors because these are the only one, the only components that I have. But uh, only you can use your your imagination to connect different sensors. In my case, you can connect this one sensor on the in the outside this one in your inside your house and this one probably to measure temperature uh, the water temperature inside your aquarium this is one of the projects that I want to do right now this is uh, my aquarium I have an, uh, an ordinary alcohol thermometer but I want to measure it with this kind of sensor and then connect the board to the internet and uh, have access uh, online to the so I can uh, read the temperature anyway anywhere I have uh, an internet connection so guys I hope you liked this article uh, this uh, video <laughs> and uh, as usual as probably you already know if you scroll a little bit below this video you will see a link where you can read the more uh, uh, info about this project there you there you'll find the circuit of how to connect each temperature sensor to the Arduino board the Arduino sketch also and a lot of great info if you like this article please subscribe to my channel I will try to post uh, more uh, Arduino related videos so we can both uh, learn more about it thank you very much and uh, see you next time bye bye